Let's move on now to the third topic today. And the third topic today is sent in to us from Xander Tanagawa, who writes, Hello, John Campia and everyone on the show. I don't know if you've heard about this. By, uh, by recently, Netflix accidentally released a show list that people can watch who are fans of Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous. Wait, what? Apparently, Netflix made a mistake of releasing their upcoming Jurassic World TV series title that was a top secret we weren't supposed to know coming this year. What's your thoughts on what this new Jurassic World series is about? Live action or animated? Thanks. All right. For those of you who don't know what Xander is talking about, there have been a bunch of headlines running around the last 24 hours that Netflix developing secret Jurassic World show is going to be called Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous and blah, blah, and all these headlines are running, right? Okay. Are they doing it? And then Xander sends, sends in a question. Saying, John, did you hear about this new Netflix Jurassic World show? Do you think it's going to be animated or live action? Which is understandable because he's seen these headlines. Here's the thing. I always tell you guys, when you see headlines that seem a little odd, track it to its source. What is the source? Where is this story coming from? Because a lot of times, no matter how many sites are running it, they'll all reference the same source. This is what the smoking gun is, as it were. This is where this whole theory has come from, that Netflix is secretly working on a Jurassic World show called Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous. This is where it all comes from. Does it come from a Universal Studio head? Nope. Did it come from Chris Pratt? Nope. Did it come from a Netflix executive? Nope. This, what I'm about to show you, is where all these headlines are coming from. It's coming from this. You see, somebody, because they probably heard that Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous was, was registered by Universal at some point, somewhere, whatever, somebody on Netflix started searching for Jurassic World Camp, and it pulled up a result saying, Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous? And then suggested other movies that and other things on Netflix that you may like if you like Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous. So this got everybody, so this was a screen capture taken by somebody and then put up into a tweet, and that start, that's what this is all coming from. <gasps> Netflix accidentally let it slip that they're working on this movie, and blah, blah, and that's, it all came from this. Now, for those of you who knew, use Netflix regularly, you already see the problem here. For those of you who don't, let me point out what the problem is. When you search for something on Netflix and then other people search for, for it on Netflix, it kind of works a little bit the way Google search works, works, right? That it will show you what other people have been searching for if something else has come up. So if one person at one point had typed in Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous and then somebody else comes around and types in Jurassic World Camp, it'll bring this up as a suggestion. That doesn't mean it is in the Netflix library, nor that it's about to be in the Netflix library. So I did a little test. I wanted to test that. So this morning, I went down to my TV, I opened up Netflix, and I thought of a film that I know is not on Netflix. Black Klansman, not on Netflix. Probably never going to be on Netflix. So I decided to do a search for Black Klansman. So surely, since Black Klansman is not on Netflix, and it's probably not going to be on Netflix, surely it won't pop up in the search results, right? Well, here's what happened. I opened up Netflix. I just typed in Black. That's it. Just B-L-A-C-K. That's all I typed. And what came up, I snapped a picture of this on my TV. Black Klansman came up as the third, as the third option. At first it did Black Mirror, because clearly lots of people search Netflix for Black Mirror. Then Blackish, and then Black Klansman came up. And look what else it says there at the top. Titles related to Black Klansman, but Black Klansman's not on Netflix. Yet it still will give you titles related to Black Klansman. And it brought up a whole bunch of other options. That does not mean that Netflix is working on a Black Klansman show. That does not mean that Black Klansman is imminently about to pop on. It just means that somebody else got on Netflix before and searched for Black Klansman. That's really all it ultimately means. So this, there are some people trying to 
you know, put forward and proposed to us that this screenshot is the smoking gun that Jurassic, that Netflix is secretly working on Jurassic World show. And I'm simply here to tell you, it's not a smoking gun. It doesn't prove anything. It doesn't prove a thing. Now, I will say this. Does this not proving anything 100% mean that Netflix is not now nor ever will be working on an original Jurassic World show? No. Just because this isn't a smoking gun and this isn't proof that they are working on something, it's not necessarily proof that it's impossible. And it's also not necessarily proof that they couldn't possibly do it. Of course it's a possibility. Anything's a possibility. Hmm. I mean, right now, Netflix could be working on a Jaws TV show, for all, we mean, for all we know, right? They could be working on a Jaws show. We got no evidence that says that they are, but they might be. And they might be working on a Jurassic World show. My only point is that this is not the smoking gun that everybody's trying to propose it to be. So I would not put any stock right now into a Universal or a, a Netflix is going to be doing a Jurassic World now. What some other people are saying is, but John didn't hear the report that Universal registered a trademark on Camp Cretaceous. Okay, yeah. But lots of studios will register and and uh, lots of names that has anything to do with their thing. It doesn't necessarily mean that's going to be the thing they do next. So, yeah, when you see people in these headlines running, take it with a grain of salt and understand there is no smoking gun.